You've seen it time and time again this year. Annual fundraising events for nonprofits being pushed to the virtual platform. Anthony Landall got a visit from Paws Giving Independence today to learn about how running with the dogs is staying strong. It's easy to stress out during a pandemic, but sometimes happiness can come just like that. And it's easier with fur therapy from Paws Giving Independence. The 12 year old non for profit is in the same boat as other small businesses, <laughs> struggling to make ends meet. Founder Donna Cosmo says training. it comes down to footing and, the veterinarian um, bill of the 24 dogs so in training. Like Until September 26th, Paws is hosting its annual Running with the Dogs race in a remote setting on participants' own time. Nearly 200 ran last year, raising over $10,000. Cosner says that won't be the case this year. Um, we know it's going to be less this year, but because our dogs continue to train and we have to continue to place them, we do need to do something to cover those costs. Trainer Laura Strock says virtual or not, any support is support for those. Yes. The number of people in our community that can benefit from these dogs is great, and we want to continue to be able to give them free of charge. So the support of the community and the donations from the community are critical to our mission. 